My name is Greg and I'm the Composites Lead at Aptera. I'm Anusha. I'm a mechanical engineer on the Body and White team. The meaning of Body and White. Historically, at the end of the production line, they dip the bodies of cars in, in white, you know, maybe in the old Ford factory or something. Body in white on a normal looking car is the outside coverings that you can see, but it's also the frame on the inside that you normally can't see. But then on the Aptera car, you can see the body in white. Like it's the outside. Like if you tried to draw like a circle around it, you just draw the whole car basically. I worked at two previous aerospace companies, all in composite structures. To be lightweight is to be structurally efficient. Um, a lot of times that points to a, a composite structure. Composites allow you to put the strength in the exact directions you need them. So we know how the car will be loaded when someone's driving it, when someone's cornering, when someone's braking. We know all of these sorts of situations that the car needs to endure. So we don't need to put metal in blanketly to make sure it's strong overall, we can put them in specific areas and specific directions that will remove some of the weight that a metal would add unnecessarily. The fact that the body in white is not even hidden is already a big efficiency. There's nothing covering it. There's not extra weight covering it. There's not extra parts to make. The whole design really only works with efficiency. A lot of body in white is making sure that we are as efficient as we can possibly be with what strength we need that the car has to handle. That's why the body and white is primarily made of composites as well, because it is the most efficient method of getting strength for a certain amount of weight. Yeah, so in my previous jobs, a lot of times, um, what you would get is a predetermined solution, um, or a list of predetermined solutions that you have to pick from the best one. Um, and at Aptera there, where we're pushing the boundaries of, of of technology, because we need to try to make the world a better place. So there's no predetermined solution. Contributing to something that's new is a lot more exciting than contributing to something that's already established. I personally have been working on the floor sills. They're one of those structural body and white parts. They connect the, the bottom of the tub with the belly pan. Engineering as a word has a Latin root even though we think it's about engines. Um, in Spanish or in Latin, it's about ingenuity. So I, I like to come to work and solve problems. Having a defense or aerospace background can help when designing the Aptera because it can inform us a lot about standardization with composite materials. Composites were basically invented for the aerospace field and they're very rarely used in everyday products. The quality that aerospace requires, whether it's composites or not, is very high and that leads to very precise and accurate, repeatable production. And that is very needed with Aptera as we move towards making thousands of cars. I am inspired by the people around me. And that's what I get at Aptera. It's a group effort. Everyone wants to be here, wants to make a good car, wants to make a better world. So that's what we're trying to do. A good Aptera employee would have a lot of patience and have a lot of motivation to find, to figure things out for the first time. I really like working here because of how it's fine to be wrong. I feel very comfortable asking questions. I think Soul looks the nicest. <laughs> I like the colors on it. <laughs> As an engineer, they're all the same to me. <laughs> so, I don't know, what do you want a better answer than that? They're all Apteras, I'll pick all of them. Give me all of, of the Apteras. I think I would go up the coast, like on the one. I think the Aptera would be really nice to kind of take by the ocean. 